I'm Adrian. And Hi, I'm Adrian. Drake. Hi, Drake. <laughs> and we're with the Santa Barbara Middle School Teen Press, here with... I am Christina Pizarro with the Coalition Against Gun Violence. Hi. Hi. So, President Obama said that more than a thousand birthdays, graduations, and anniversaries have been stolen from our lives by a bullet from a gun. What's something kids our age can do to prevent gun violence? Kids your age? should demand a plan to end gun violence. This is a social media world. I don't know if you have a Twitter account, but tweet, we demand a plan. Talk to your fellow students. Let them know that it is okay to talk about gun violence because it, ha it affects us all as kids, as even college students. I'm a college student. And uh, just talk about it Ex and tell your parents. Have a conversation. Open it up. Yeah. So what's something the whole city of Santa Barbara can, can do to prevent gun violence? I think that we need to come together collectively. We need to continue to demand that plan. We need to engage each and every single community resident and talk about it. Teach each other, educate each other, and make sure that we move forward and we need to support legislation that supports the end of gun violence and takes those horrible big assault rifles out of our schools, out of our theaters, shopping malls, and even it could happen on State Street. And we, we deserve better. Yeah. What kind of guns should people be able to use in the, around America, the country? What kind of gun should people be able to use? Mm -hmm. Well, the Second Amendment gives the, the right for individuals to own a gun. But if you are going to own a gun, if I have a child like your age or your age, I would make sure that I'm a responsible gun owner and I would lock it up. I would not leave it for you or your friends, or your friends, to come and take that gun and use it out of curiosity. I would lock it up. Be a responsible gun owner. What do you think this discussion tonight accomplished? I think we've accomplished a great deal. It gives me tremendous joy to see you folks here from the teen press and uh, community members. We have a diverse community that has come out here to hear, to educate themselves, to come in solidarity to end gun violence. I think that this is a first step. And I think that we need to continue to engage the community and make sure that we continue to have this conversation. There's been a lot of talk about um, armed guards being stationed at um, theaters and schools. What do you think about that? I think that's a bad idea and I agree with the panelists here and I think she should know she is an educator and she is from our county education board. I don't, I wouldn't feel comfortable with that. Kids are supposed to go to school and be safe. They should be with their backpacks. They should have nutrition time, recess time with their friends, not seeing an armed guard. We need to feel safer and I will fight as an adult so that you kids feel safer. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it. All right, well, thank you. Well, thank you.